press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Hi everybody and welcome to five over exhibition cricket. It's a thrill and a spill. I'm your host Mark Nicholas and this shapes up to be an hour of power. This is a hard surface and it looks to me as if it'll have even bounce and good carry through to the wicket keeper. I'd be batting first if I won this toss. This is a batsman's pitch. I'm amazed that he's chosen to bowl first. It's firm, there's no real covering of grass. I think the bounce will be even. I'd expect a lot of runs today. So, we're all ready for the first ball of the innings. Field is a peel, but uh, he was quite comfortable home. The batsmen changed their mind. It's straight to a fielder. Mohammed Hafiz waiting at the striker's end. That went a long way back into stands. Effortless, brilliant and maximum. The sweeper picks up. They turn that into two, that's good running. Oh, that's a gift, just a gift, and this guy's too good to ignore gifts like that. Four from the moment he hit it, there's a skill in that. Picking the gap is a skill. The bowling side are now allowed more players outside the ring as the fielding restrictions have been lifted. Ah, he picked it up nicely and it's got him four more. It's straight to a fielder. There's some overthrows here. Overthrows, and it's gifting runs to the opposition. He's overstepped, you can see it clearly. You know, I think he's trying too hard. Played into the gap. There's the umpire signal, no ball. Should be some runs here. The umpire's not certain, so he's requesting the third umpire. He's got the green light, he's safe.
That easily cleared the boundary. No, the bowler won't be happy about that. He's in it miles. That's cleared the rope. Six runs. Yep. He's worked that into the gap. I think he was easily back in the first there. It's a good plan this by the batsman. You can sense that they want to run the field as ragged. Such pressure and mistakes will come. Oh, it's a monster. Side for any bowler. The ball is just sailing over the fence. Well, that was six as soon as he hit it. He loves driving the ball, especially through the covers, and frankly, there's no one better at it. An easy cut. An early wicket is something you strive for. You have your team meetings, you prepare all morning. That will put pressure back on the batsman. Oh, you sense the crowd and his own team aren't happy with that. He was set and ready to go. Let's take a look at that in uh, slow motion. The next batsman is Shaw Mike. Somewhat costly, very costly. He'll need to improve on it if he's going to stay in the attack. I think. Done. He's not a good judge of a run, is he? Super stroke. Do you know, I didn't think that was a bad ball either. Shayad Malik absolutely smashed that for six. You can't set fields for a shot like that. Brilliant. Well, he hardly seemed to hit it, and it's six. Oh, he looks good when he hits down the ground. Very good. That was sheer power. It doesn't matter if it's in the air when you hit it that far.
Mohammed Hafiz waiting at the striker's end. Well, it was a promising start, but you sort of felt the team needed more. Let's uh, see the action replay of that. Ijaz Ali is the next man in. Ijaz Ali facing. Super cash. Comes to be taken. No worries. Very safely done. He's got soft hands, his eyes were level, crucially held on to as well. He just only goes for a He's back in the pavilion, and there's a big round zero alongside his name. We can have a look at that again. Well, a player of this quality just doesn't miss out on opportunities like that. Onto it in a flash. It's straight to a foolish running, that's simply throwing wickets away.